Thompson's guilty verdict has a lot of people in this community outraged. Others are ecstatic. KXLY 4's Kylie Cruz is live at the zip trip where it all started. Kylie? Kali, after five and a half years, people in the Spokane community finally have an answer in the Otto Zim case. And earlier today, members of the Peace and Justice Action League of Spokane held a rally outside of City Hall. Now, some of the members said they were a little shocked by the guilty verdict, but they're pleased with it. And they hope it sends a strong message to city leaders. It was a time of discussion and remembrance. We wanted to be here today no matter what verdict came down. Huddled together in a circle with candles and signs. People of all ages came to the PJALS rally to show their support for Otto Zim, hoping to make a statement to city leaders. Whether Thompson was found guilty or innocent, we need to look farther than any single case and any single officer. Some of them were quite surprised by the outcome, but hope it makes a difference. I hope that it's a real break in the pattern and not just sort of a blip. This verdict is what we need to get some more juice into the police accountability move on the part of the city. Accountability, this group hopes, changes police policy in the future. I hope that, um, that our elected officials will take a very proactive approach to changing the training manual, to changing our use of force policies. Today, supporters of Otto Zim weren't the only ones making their voices heard. The We Support Carl Thompson Facebook page has over 500 followers. We stand behind you 100% Carl. Stay strong Carl, keep fighting the good fight. We believe in you Carl and are devastated. We're just a few of the comments posted on that page earlier today. Despite the positive and negative reaction to the verdict, there's one thing people can agree on. Otto Zem is gone and his family is still, in, uh, is still grieving for him. And members of the PJALS group hopes this verdict brings about change in this community. What it does is tell the community that that uh, there is a possibility of seeing justice when that kind of egregious violence is done to an innocent person. Now people are still commenting that on that support page for Carl Thompson. One of the most recent comments says, Carl, you are a great man and us rookie cops should model ourselves after a year. You did things the right way for over 40 years and we are behind you on all of this. Reporting live outside of the zip trip here on Division, I'm Kylie Cruz, KXLY4 HD News.